spectroscopic analysis. Now, I know that sounds complicated, but it's not really. You're just bouncing a known quality of light off of a piece of matter, and then studying that interaction by seeing what bounces back. Some people refer to this as light spectrometry, but that's not to get it confused with mass spectrometry, which gives you a lot more granular analysis, but requires big, expensive machines. By comparison, light spectrometry can be done with small, inexpensive components. And as such, we've decided to create breakout boards for two such components. The AS7262 and AS7263 are spectral sensors in two different spectrums, one in the visible spectrum and one in the near infrared. Using sensors like this, you can determine things like photosynthetic light use efficiency, you can find certain toxic compounds in blood samples, you can even identify certain compounds in food samples. To make these sensors easier to use, we've laid them out on breakout boards with super bright white LEDs as an illumination source. However, if you would like to use an incandescent bulb instead for better black body radiation analysis, we have supplied a two pin connection for low voltage incandescent bulbs. These sensors communicate using the I2C protocol, so we've supplied a 0.1 inch I2C header as well as two quick connectors, which allow you to connect this board to other quick compatible boards without having to solder anything. The firmware on these sensors not only reports levels of flux at six different wavelengths in their respective spectra, but they also allow you to control the current to the light source, thus allowing you to expose your sample at different levels during analysis. Spectroscopy has never been this simple or this inexpensive, so if you've ever been interested in playing with it in the home lab, this is your way in. Light of a refer to it as oh so close sensors in two different bands. The mm-hmm photosynthetic burst coming from a super bright white LED. Mad on breakout board. On on breakout. We laid them out on breakout board.